This is Michael from Machination Studio. I've just returned from the US and found the time to edit this video of the New York Comic Con 2015. I thoroughly enjoyed myself at the con and every one of you contributed to make it a great experience. I would really like to thank my friends Mike from Brooklyn for helping me at the stand for three days and for letting me use this apartment as a base of operations. And also Ben, who came down from Pittsburgh just to help me for two days. And later, you know, when I went up to visit him, hosted me at his place. They made it, you know, just possible for me to just get to see some of the con and to go to the washroom. <laughs> it was, you know, I couldn't have done it without some help from them. I would also like to thank Wong Fong Research and Innovation Center for all the support and lucidity for a lot of the graphics that you guys see at the stand. I wouldn't you know, be able to come to the con without their help in the first place. And finally, all of you guys who came by and all the kind words that you shared with me. It's really useful and valuable to me to have met you guys face to face and get a real sense of how Say hi. people feel about my stuff. Wow. This video is just a short one to share a little of the behind the scenes stuff before the con opened. And also to give those guys who could not make it to the con a little glimpse of what it was like. Of course, I can't do justice to what was on offer at the con in this, in this video. I wish I had more time to get around, you know, getting better footage. But my main priority was to be at the stand and talk to, you know, a lot of you guys and, and got your feedback. Up to now, I guess Codename Colossus was pretty much have been a solo project, mostly done by myself and, and, and largely for myself. After talking to many of you guys at the New York Comic Con, I found that I do have some opportunities to extend what I'm doing. And, and I've met people and, and, and you know, potential collaborative partnerships are starting to take shape in my head. But more importantly, an idea is starting you know, to form in my mind of how I can build upon the experience of creating Coding Colossus and the feedback that you guys have been sharing with me to bring a product to you guys. This is not yet a sales pitch, but I will very soon start on a new design process that is suitable and scalable for small production runs, probably either resin casting and or soft tooling injection molding, probably both if the demand is high enough. Right, the design will probably work in the form of a garage kit as well as a completed toy. I think a, a big part of the feedback was that a lot of you guys asked, does this come in a kit? So that's something I want to explore. And also various um, levels of detail at different price points. I think this can be achieved. I'm definitely thinking about an integration into some form of game mechanics, right? Some form of uh, miniature of, uh, or board game mechanics. That's something I really want to explore as well. At this stage, you know, I'm not able to set any sort of timetable because I'm still not fully clear how complex this would be. But I can definitely say that I'm starting right now to, to, to start thinking and designing like from today onwards. I'm also leaning towards a crowdfunding campaign um, for both a marketing reason and also as a feedback of how much demand there is for my idea. But that also has its risk. And that also means I have to work doubly hard to make sure that my production methods and are reliable and can keep up with the demand.
So for those who are newly aware of Codename Colossus or you know, have met me the first time at the con, please do check out the videos in the channel and, and, and the website to see what I've done previously and to see it, uh, the two years of work that's come to um, create Codename Colossus. But, you know, for everyone, please do watch this space and I will update you guys as my, my plans take shape. So thank you very much for watching and enjoy.